Hi everybody. So great to see you all here. Thank you so much for joining me on Marade Mondays. And it's beautiful and sunny and kind of windy, but it's okay, it's all great. And I am so, 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 so excited for later on because Marade by Marade squared is going to be on my dear 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 friend Maraid Carlin from Celtic Woman so she is just amazing and I can't wait to catch up with her and I can't wait for you guys to to have your comments and your questions and everything and it's so exciting <laughs> So, I have another little exclusive for you today. Um, I have a beautiful, beautiful video that hasn't been seen yet by the amazing Tim Janis, who has uh, arranged and directed this beautiful video. And I'm going to be putting it up on my YouTube channel um, separately as well. But I just wanted you guys to see it here first, okay? And it is um, beautiful music, uh, tunes called Oh Roshi the Bahawaya, and a tune also from my mother's book as well. But I hope you enjoy this video. It was shot um, in different locations uh, in Ireland and here in the US and different places. So I hope you like it. I loved um, doing it and I hope you enjoy it. It's an exclusive. Thanks everyone coming back 
for their lessons every week. I really, really appreciate it. It's so easy. Book your lesson on moraidnesbethrylin.com and the more you book, the better deal it is as well. And it's so great to see everyone every week. And thank you so much to Brianna Le Liver of USA, Paolo Lafarge of France, and from the USA, Catherine Richter, Stephen Parker, Kenton Showalter, Paloma Herrera, Bethany Ward, Ramdas P. Lai, Elizabeth Callanan, Kathy Thiberville, and Tiffany Moore. Thank you so much, everyone, for coming back for your lessons, and see you soon for your next lesson. sounds out here it's fantastic so I just want to thank you very very much for the people who have bought violins from my website moraidnesbethviolins.com um, I would love to say thank you to John Hills California who bought a reining up model Christopher Hopkins AL in USA a butterfly model Lisa Bybee New Hampshire in the USA a butterfly model plus a custom bow and Christopher Baker in Tennessee you got a Bell of Tipperary model and thank you thank you so very very much I hand pick the violins myself and I get them set up and they're set up impeccably so thank you so so very much they're finished off in New York they're um, made in Europe and finished off in New York in the USA so um, they are really beautiful instruments I really appreciate it thank you Hi everyone, thank you so much for your patience in me saying thank you to people who support my websites. I really, really uh, really appreciate everyone and you know if you want to support musicians at this time that's what you do and thank you thank you so very much you saw that video that is carl nesbitt now he has the most amazing youtube channel and he um does tutorials and the tutorials on the channel are free they're free so uh, these are this is Carl's uh, details here. The tutorials are free, and also there's you know if you want to take it a bit further and learn, let's say uh, classical percussionists um, have always been saying to me, oh I'd love to learn the baron and I'd love to learn um, a different you know the different rhythms that of the Irish style and whatever you know. So there's three tutorials on a baron, bazooki, flute, whistle. So lots and lots there um, to, to choose from. So his uh, email is flutetricks at hotmail.com. Here's Carl in action, um, just with the Devil's Bit sessions, the family album, and it was at home. And the Devil's Bit is the local mountain. And the Celtic spell for today, by the way, is when the devil was flying over the mountain, it took a bite out of the mountain, flew over the Rock of Cashel and spat it out. And that's the Celtic spell for today. And that is how the Rock of Cashel came <laughs> and the devil's bit. So here's Carl.
As always, I love to do a tune from Kathleen Nesbitt's Fiddle Tutorial and 41 Track CD. It is the most amazing book and uh, loads of amazing tunes, amazing slow wares, jigs, hornpipes, reels, of course, rare and well known. And of course, huge information on uh, ornamentation, both for your left hand and your right hand so much uh, information almost four books in one so uh, i'd love to play this tune called O'Callaghan slide it's on page 88 of the book and i'm getting lots of competition from nature which is fantastic all the nature sounds so i hope you like it <laughs> everyone too who bought from the music section of mariednesbethviolin.com thank you so very very much i just want to name you out because it's it's wonderful and thank you for your support martin haynes of munich germany you got the fiddle tutorial by my mother kathleen nesbitt it's signed by kathleen and myself and you also got the devil's bit sessions the family cd and dvd and that looks like that and the devil's bit is the local mountain near us at home and this dvd is on back order so that's going to follow your order is going out uh, this week and um the D dvd will follow that's on back order but it will be in soon and you also got the vista point cd from my brother carl and that looks like that here as well and You've seen Carl earlier, you can uh, subscribe to Carl's channel on Carl Nesbitt and um, there's lots of free fantastic tutorials on there for every instrument. <laughs> he's a multi-instrumentalist and um, his lessons email is flutrix at hotmail.com. So the next order was Dee Boswell of Illinois, USA. You ordered the Hibernia album, my uh, solo CD. Thank you so much looks like that thank you so very very much and you also ordered the devil's bit sessions dvd which is on back order as i said and that'll go out to you shortly as well and britta shadwell of new york usa you ordered hibernia thank you britta thank you so much <laughs> and perry hiramoto of oregon usa the nesbitt collection that's all the cds and dvd um, sent out to you as well so thank you so very much everybody for ordering from Raid Nesbitt violin.com and solstice.shop as well for my Celtic inspired jewellery which I have on me here and uh, thank you so much
everyone. I'm back. I'm back here sitting down. So I am so, so, so excited. Oh my goodness, I can't contain my excitement. Um, we we actually, myself and Marie tested um, this link um, uh, this morning and we had a good old catch up, but we're going to catch up more. But um, I want to, in honor of Mairead, just to, before we get into it, I um, someone said to me last week um, that musicians have really, really, really um, brought everybody up, really lifted everyone up in this time. And I think it's, it's um, a wonderful thing that every musician, I think I know, <laughs> including myself and including uh, Mairead and her brilliant, brilliant husband, Ronan Scollard, um, have done amazing collaborations. And um, this is a beautiful, beautiful video from their home. And I hope you enjoy it. And I know you're really excited to see Mairead, but have a listen here and I know you're going to love it. You give me a million reasons to let you go You give me a million reasons to quit the show You give me a million reasons Give me a million reasons Give me a million reasons About a million reasons If I could find a highway I would run for the hills If you could find a dryway I'd forever be still But you've given me a million reasons About a million reasons Give me a million reasons This worn out leather. I've got a hundred million reasons to walk away. Oh, baby, I just need one good one to stay. amazing is that how amazing is that are you all crying because oh my god that's just stunning stunning as always Mary Carlin has the most crystal beautiful beautiful voice and um, that was her husband Ronan and he's the most amazing composer and arranger and singer as well and I just want to bring up this lovely picture of Mary and I'm going to go to this side Woo! <laughs> so I know she has a story about this picture, so she said she was going to come on and explain that, but I think it's so stunning. And I want to do a proper introduction for Mairead because I love her so, so, so very much. Uh, Mairead, as you know, was born in Derry in the north of Ireland, and her life has been immersed in music since the early days and coming from a family whose love of song was passed down to her generation. Uh, Derry, my hometown, is a very cultured and musical place. Wherever you turn, there's always music. There's especially true for Mairead's family, 
she said, we'd just sit around the fire and sing and drink tea and probably Barry's tea. I don't know, maybe. <laughs> she has toured with the legendary American singer-songwriter Don McLean, including a sell-out concert at the Royal Albert Hall. Mairead's voice has been featured on many film soundtracks, including 47 Ronan, Harry Potter, Lord of the Rings and Arlen Partridge. And Mairead has been with the super group Celtic Woman since 2013, I think Mairead it was, and singing with the best symphony orchestras and singing in the best venues worldwide. A motto she has used throughout her career so far is a quote from the award-winning Irish poet Seamus Heaney, sing yourself to where the singing comes from. And with that, it is just my absolute honor and privilege to introduce Mairead Carlin. Hi, Mairead. Hello. Oh, thank you so much, Mairead, for coming on. You're so fantastic and everybody loves you. And what an amazing video that was. And I have another one as well with, with Ronan. And, you know, it's just how, how amazing everyone is. Uh, the musicians are stepping up, but especially you and Ronan. Oh, Mairead, I have to say, you had me crying with that new video that you released. Oh. It is stunning. Like, and I haven't, I haven't even, it's very windy here, and I haven't oh. even put it up yet. I just wanted people to have a quick, <laughs> thank you, love. Thank you. Oh, it's gorgeous. So generous. Thank you so much. Um, but listen, Marie, you said you had a bit of a story about that beautiful photo we were looking at. <laughs> <laughs> that photo, would you believe it, even though I'm giving it full, you know, whack, that was the night that I realized that there was something seriously wrong with me. So I thought that I had a stomach bug yeah. um, and that photo was taken, I think that photo was taken in Zurich and I was really, really sick on stage. But you know the way Maria, the show must go on. So you have to just, you know, do your best even though you're not feeling very well. So uh, after that show, I had a, an 18 hour bus journey. journey yes. With a pest. And then I had my appendix out, so, <laughs> but you never would have known. You never, ever would have known. Absolutely not. And I mean, you're just such a, you're such a, a trooper. You really are. And I have another beautiful photo here, I'm right. This is a gorgeous <laughs> photo of you. I was in, in fighting health there, so I haven't got any appendix uh, issues there. <laughs> oh, beautiful. And do you remember this? Oh, my goodness, Mairead. Look at that. Isn't that a beautiful photo? I'll put it up for people again. That's oh. my, I think that was one of my favorite um, costumes, that, like the, the group of costumes that we wore in Celtic Woman. It's one of my favorites. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. They're so, so amazing. Mm -hmm. And um, that weekend, Mairead, will you ever forget it for Destiny? It was the time we were nominated for a Grammy for yeah. Destiny. How incredible was that weekend? It was, it really was. And you're so cute, because I hadn't seen you in ages. And then just to see you there, I got really emotional. But um, I just want to tell everybody a really funny story. Um, we were sitting, we were sitting in the Grammys, and I was sitting beside Marie because we're joined to the hip. Whenever we're together, it's literally like we're attached. <laughs> and um, Marie was like, "You were squeezing my hand so tight." And then we were, we hadn't even considered that there was a possibility that we could have won. We were just grateful that we were there for the nomination. And the next thing, Marie turns to me, she goes. What are we going to say if we win? Who's going to say it? And we were trying to figure out who was going to say what if we got up on stage. <laughs> it was like, well, we hadn't even thought that far. We're just happy to be here. <laughs> I know. We were so happy to be there. And, and, and that's right. I mean, I remember, oh, sure, look, you know, it's great to be here, isn't it? You know, yeah. and, and, <laughs> and then that, the, the, the look of terror came across all of us. And we were all looking at each other. What are we going to say? <laughs> who was going to talk or anything you know and here is this oh wow this beautiful photo in front of the granny sign again oh. beside each other joined at the hip <laughs> oh oh my gosh what a weekend and here's us having the laughs i think that was the oh. form right <laughs> oh, that was the party wasn't it that was the grammy party the that yeah. was the Grammy party and yeah. and you know yeah. just just wonderful and yeah oh god 
It's that way. <laughs> oh, <laughs> and one more. And there is us. Oh, I love that one. That's one of my favorites. Most in our achievements. Oh, my gosh. And, you know, just the achievement for being there and to have the Grammy medallion. Yeah. I think it was made by Tiffany, wasn't it? Made by Tiffany's. And um, oh my goodness, it's just incredible. I still have to hang that up. <laughs> Mine's still in the box, and I have to say I shouldn't admit this, but I've moved house like three times since then. Oh and I thought it had gone missing. Oh my gosh. I yeah. had I was so upset. Ronan Ronan, I'll tell you, I was crying. I was like, how can I be? So, like, how can I misplace something as precious and as important as this? No. And the next thing, I checked it as if I had put it away. Do you know when you put something away for safekeeping? Yes, you put it away I do. <laughs> well, that it's like Tuesday. Well, I know exactly where it is now, but do you know that moment where your heart just drops? <laughs> oh, my gosh. What an amazing time. And, you know, I'm... I had the pleasure, Mairead, of being on tour with you for a few years because I've been in Celtic Woman since the very beginning. And I tell you what, when you came in, I was just so delighted. And you're so, you're just such a generous, generous spirit, you know. And you're so, you keep everyone uplifted. And you just, you're so amazing. And what a voice. Incredible. I, I mean, I, I just treasured those years, Mairead. Yeah, so yeah, I like I you're certainly one of the most special people that I've ever met, right? And you know I'm just like I'm very honest and I wear my heart on my sleeve. Um and I'm just so grateful that I met you and you're just so talented, so special, but you're just an incredible spirit. And I do I do miss you. I miss you dearly on the road. Um and just your energy and your vibe and just your little like giggle. <laughs> Your cups of tea <laughs> and your dark chocolate. <laughs> oh, the dark chocolate is very important. Absolutely important. But listen, um, and we're going to go to comments in a minute because I'd say they're exploding. Um, I just wanted, uh, you know, us to have the chats first and everything. So I did go through my phone, right, and I found a, a, a humdinger of a photo. <laughs> I found this. This is when we were, go that way. So you go in the middle. So. <laughs> oh, oh right! <laughs> There's us with our cowboy hats on, everyone. Isn't that in? That's in San Antonio, is it? I think so. Yeah, yeah I have no so. idea where it is. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? It's just um, I you know that's what I get for going through my phone. But you know, I love keeping these photos because they're they're memories. You know, they're so precious, so so precious. And um, so look, let's go to comments you know, and just see what's going on here. <laughs> Hi, oh, Mary. Um, Fox. <laughs> and Mary. Mary. M by M squared. <laughs> Behind the scenes. Oh, thanks, Perry. <laughs> yes. <laughs> She's the better, Mary. <laughs> no, 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 not at all. <laughs> so, Stephen, Oh, look, I missed you in, in New Brunswick, so he'll get to see you again. Oh, what is your favorite song to play that Mairead Carlin to sing? Oh, um, we've we've loads, haven't we, Mairead? Um, you yeah, know, I, I have my favorite that we've done. You? Manana Heron. Oh, of course, mm -hmm. Manana Heron. Yeah. Oh, my God, I love Manana Heron. And just for people, uh, translated, Manana Heron means women of Ireland women of ireland so i um i love that song too i love that song too an awesome photo of you both thanks a million that must be the cowboy hats <laughs> <laughs> we're wearing cowboy boots <laughs> that is cute cowboy hats maraids <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness hi girls from brazil and we love brazil yeah, we really do and can't wait to see you on tour when it resumes next year i know and we're going to be talking about that um shortly so oh my god you are so um uh as i am excited i'm sure about the new celtic woman cd celebration wow yeah. that's mm -hmm. that's going to be amazing because it celebrates 15 years of music I'm so, right. Can you believe it? I can't. Like, I'm, I'm in the group. I'm in the group eight years now coming up, and like 
15 years of a legacy and you were there from the very beginning you were there watching it grow and what it must feel like to see it 15 years on oh. and all the amazing people that have come through but you are the integral part of all that you know it's it's amazing oh, thanks Mairead I mean it's just how how did they manage two Mairead's on tour <laughs> you know we're easy to manage <laughs> lovely girls greetings from switzerland hope to see you all together again and we're we're yeah i mean you've you've done uh, the tuesday takeovers too with on celtic mm -hmm. woman's facebook page and you know the instagram the twitters and um you know i'm doing it tomorrow yeah i'm so happy you're doing it it's brilliant oh my god, oh my god. i'm going to be i'm going to be firing phones and computers around the place <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> get, your, get your questions ready get your questions ready and um so lovely seeing you two you definitely need to collaborate more yes we do and um of course you know Mairead has the most amazing accolades and um her beautiful solo album and you know all the albums of Celtic Woman and you know every album of Celtic Woman have have, have have done so well and um it's thanks to all our fans out there Marie isn't it we I call them my family what about you yeah they're so important like you know well you've always said like the audience are the fifth member of Celtic Woman um, or the sixth member depending which year you were in Celtic Woman <laughs> exactly <laughs> But you know, they like we wouldn't be here at the end of the day without you guys. You're so important to us, and especially now, actually, you know, when you when you take time to actually remove yourself from being on the road, you realize just how important the fans are because this has been a testing time for all of us. Um, yeah. And just getting those little messages in every day saying we can't wait to see you again and we can't wait to see you again. So yeah. it's the same for you too, isn't it, Marie? Absolutely, Mairead, you know, I mean, it's just, I can't wait to, because, I mean, I got to see, I went to um, uh, one of the concerts last last year yeah. when you were over, and yeah. I got to meet up with all you guys, and we had such a great, no, two nights, we had great yeah. two nights. It was brilliant, and it was just so fun, and we all just kind of, <laughs> yeah, yeah, and I, I just want to kind of meet up, meet up again tomorrow oh. you know and 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 meet up meet up next year you know when when you guys are back on tour but you're going to be back on tour again for the for the um uh maybe for the christmas tour right well we hope so um you know obviously things are out of our hands at the moment so but the thing is it's still planning to go ahead we're going full steam ahead and we're hoping that that will remain in place um and like the world is is like I said, out of our hands, but we're hoping, fingers crossed. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I think you're doing, um, I, 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 you know, obviously we follow each other in socials and everything, and you're doing so well, and and Ronan as well, doing so amazing on on your socials and, and just keeping everyone, as I said, uplifted. But but all your collaborations are incredible. And we did one together recently, Guy. <laughs> we did one together recently, and it was arranged by the brilliant Ronan Scollard and um, featuring Mairead Carlin, it has to be said, featuring oh, Mairead Mairead Carlin <laughs> <laughs> and featuring um, uh, Kevin McKidd from Grey's Anatomy. I didn't know he could sing. He's a nice singer. He's a good singer. He's more than a good singer, isn't he? I, Because I'd heard him on the space, it was the thing with the space side sessions, which um, was it's so weird because I was meant to do the original Space Side Sessions and I never got a chance to. Um, and it was my friend Jamie who had set it up initially, and he's really good friends with Kevin the kid. Um, so when the COVID hit, um, Kevin and Jamie wanted to do something to give back, you know. Yeah. Um, and then so Jamie got in contact with me, and I was like, I'm getting Ray Nesbitt involved in this one now. So then it's, I love that it's opened this whole other world, this whole other folky world. And I, I actually think it's only the very beginning of that. I think great things will come from these collaborations and great friends as well, you know. Great friends, great causes, 
because mm -hmm. this collaboration, as, as most of them are, are for COVID uh, relief funds. And this particular one uh, was for the uh, Trussell, Trussell Trust um, food banks in the UK. And um, I'd love to play a little bit of it. And I hope you guys enjoy this. This is way to hear more this. Wow. Oh, goodness. <laughs> Leave a light on for the many Leave a light on for the few For the time when we are ready To be guided home to you Leave a light on for How amazing was that? I, I and I thank you so very much, guys, for <clears throat> bringing me into that because that was I, I, what a beautiful song. Oh, it is a beautiful song. Um, when we first heard it, I think I was pretty floored because of the message. Um, but you know what I love? I you know I've always loved this, but I call it your Jimi Hendrix moment <laughs> when you like, scrub the um, strings on the fiddle. Oh, Marie, I love that. You just, oh, you're so special. You're so talented. Oh, my, it's just, uh, that's like the, you know, the classical heads called, uh, you know, the, 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 Sul Ponticello, you know, when you have that screech, you know, against the bridge. And then um, I just call it my Jimi Hendrix effect. <laughs> <laughs> I'll give it that one. I love, I love Jimi Hendrix. <laughs> oh, oh, good. Well, yeah, I do too. Oh, there's, there's some great comments coming in. Uh, what a beautiful collaboration and thank you guys for, for being here and and wow so listen Mairead what's what's next now is there any more collaborations coming up I have a, a lovely uh, a lovely video of you anyway doing your collaborations but I know you always you have you always have something going on <laughs> um, I actually am doing a really cool collaboration with a guy called Chris Difford, he was in the band Squeeze. Um, I don't know if people know uh, Jules Holland, um, but he basically does these songwriting camps. Um, but he decided to do one online. So there's like 20 of us, 20 musicians, and we were paired up. So there's some amazing people on there. Um, Beth Nielsen Chapman's doing a song. Um, there's lo loads and loads of different people. Huardine, who um, writes a lot with the folk singer called Eddie Reader. Uh, mm -hmm. So and I, yeah, and I love Eddie Reader so much. Um, but I'm actually paired up, and Chris Difford didn't know this whenever he paired us up, but another girl from Derry called Ro. Oh, yeah. Uh, so, yeah, so we, we were paired up, and we've been writing a song together over the last week. So it's really different because we're very different artists. Like, she's very much electro pop yeah and obviously folk e slash americana e classical thing um but it's been so nice and the proceeds for that will go to people on the front line as well so trying our best you know to try and raise money through music and collaborations absolutely yeah. and it's just um right it's just great that you're you, you know um people really it's now that people need uh money really more than ever you know and and just just to to keep going and you know it's um you know it's great i, I mean i love doing the collaborations as well with people and um it, it just brings me such joy as well and especially when i got to do that with you and ronan it was great <laughs> oh, and just i always want to do more of that Maraid, honestly and i just miss singing with you as well do you know what i found the other day what did you find i was going through my emails and i was trying to find stuff and i was like oh Oh my goodness, remember the track that we did in Australia with Brian McGrain? It was called Song for Janice. Oh, yes. Yeah. I do remember that. Oh my God. I know. Oh, I don't have it. I don't have that. I'll send you. It's it's really cool. <laughs> send it to me and I'll play it one of the weeks. That'll be fantastic. Yeah. Thank you so much. And um, so, really, I guess we, are, we, just, we, we just kind of always sink Marie, don't we we always um 
we just pick up where we left off all the time. And um, I know I know you're really busy now and I know people want to have you on all night, but we're just going to just look at a few more comments and <laughs> just see. Yes, please. Oh, sing for some raid. Oh. <laughs> Hi. Hi from New Hampshire. And we do have another video and we have, um, yes, Ronan is so amazingly talented. <laughs> yes, he is. <laughs> He's currently playing. I think he's playing electric guitar upstairs. <laughs> I can <Yeah>. hear him. <laughs> That's amazing. That is amazing. Uh, what do you do? You, either of you think you'll have shows going on this summer? Well, what do you think, Marie, for yourself first? Basically, it's hard, to know. it's hard to know. Like we can't really plan anything until yeah, you know, the world kind of goes slightly back to normal. We actually, for hope for people all around the world, um, today in Ireland, uh, our five kilometer, ra kilometer radius was opened up to 20. So I went into town today and I had my little face mask on and I got a coffee from an independent coffee shop and I felt really normal again. I felt like life was maybe resuming a little bit. So that's hopeful, isn't it? It is hopeful. It absolutely is hopeful. And I'm trying to, I'm being, I'm being caught on the, on the hop now. That my, But my friend, Tiffany Moore, Tiffany Lauren. Okay, now, our favorite memories. Oh, my goodness. There's so many. There's just so many, isn't there? Um, yeah. Together. <laughs> I, I Truthfully, it's not even like, for me, it's not even like shows or anything like that. It's actually just getting to know you as a friend. Um. Oh. Like our little like nights when we would sit up and chat on the tour bus and those kind of things. And I know, and things. they were great talks. <laughs> yeah. Putting the world to rights. Well, performing with you on stage as well, Marie. I mean, what an honor. You know, I have always looked up to you. And oh, just, Marie. Oh, look, back at you, you know, and uh, I just... Um, you know, I think I think all my favorite my favorite times too were off the tour bus. People are saying, "Oh, you know, what's it like being on tour?" It's hard work, guys. It's hard, hard work. And and but the best thing is being in front of an audience with Ray Carlin and all <laughs> the girls on stage. You know, it's just absolutely amazing. And it's it, you just couldn't ask for better. You know, and uh, the audiences as well are, are always amazing for us. They really are, aren't they, Ray? Yeah, I think there's something really special about the audiences that we have because it's almost as if they're on stage with you. I don't think audiences realise how important they are to how you feel on stage. Like sometimes yeah. they feel like they're not, you know, part of the show, but they are absolutely part of the show, aren't they? That's right. I'm about to take flight here. <laughs> <laughs> so when you look great though, it's like a it's like a wind machine. <laughs> if it's going this direction it would be great you know it'd be like all Beyonce and stuff you know I'll just pretend that I have the same wind machine <laughs> so Neve Murphy says yay for Ireland absolutely yay for oh, Ireland yay. <laughs> aloha from Hawaii oh I love goodness Hawaii. <laughs> Hawaii, don't you Marie I know oh <laughs> look you are like magic and um, right what are, you, what are you drinking there Marie a cup of tea hey. And um, actually, there's a bit of lipstick on it. I'll, I'll rub it off so it doesn't look horrible. But it says on this side, oh. oh, that's beautiful. Oh, my gosh, that's beautiful. <laughs> oh. Maraid, love your fields of Athen Rye. Well, she sings every song. Absolutely amazing. That's David <laughs> Overmeyer. Oh, thanks for the best Maraid Mondays ever. I know, right? How am I going to top this? I mean... Um, no. <laughs> <I love Tom. laughs> <Aww>. <laughs> greetings from mexico yay oh my goodness maraid i mean i i just you know please everyone follow obviously you do but follow maraid on all her socials um she has like obviously got a great you know viewership and everything all her socials and her facebook instagram twitter and all that and um I just, uh, I, it's just so exciting for me to have you on, Raid. I really, really appreciate it. I, I don't want to let you go. I know you're busy and I don't want to let you go. <laughs> we were so, uh, oh my goodness, five celebrations shows in Florida. They saw greetings from France. <laughs> Top it. 
Woohoo! Um, <laughs> Still am. Yeah. Oh, we love Lisa. <laughs> love your smile, Maraid Carlin. I love her smile too. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Maraid, oh my gosh. Well, look, you're so good for coming on, and I know you have other stuff to be doing now. And really, I appreciate it so much. And we have an amazing performance from, from you and Ronan here. And I want to really, really thank you so much. You know, I love you so, so very much. And I'm going to catch up with you during the week. Yes. Okay. Um, yes. Yes. And big love to Ronan. Okay. And thank you, darling. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me on. I feel so honored. Thank you so much. I love you the best. Oh, oh I love you to bits too, Mairead. Have a great night. Okay. Mm -hmm. Bye, Mairead. Bye, Bye, thank you. Bye, darling. Oh, and now I have a gorgeous performance from Maraid and Ronan. Wait till you hear this. This is so stunning. to play another tune from my mother Kathleen Nesbitt's fiddle tutorial and CD and it is on viola this time why not and uh, this tune is a beautiful slow air fun mal and it is uh, a version of Sean O'Dear on Glanner uh, John of the Glen and I have that slow air on my CD, my Hibernia CD, but this is a different version and it's on page 49 of the Fiddle tutorial. Hope you like it.
called the Earl Lana, John of the Glen, from this Glen. <laughs> Everybody, thank you so, so very much for joining myself and Marie Carlin, my very, very special guest this week. I love her to bits, as you know, and as you know, it's very obvious and we're the best and best of friends. So um, tomorrow I'm going to be taking over Celtic Woman's socials. Take over Tuesday for tomorrow. And um, so it's going to be a Facebook Live uh, Q&A at uh, 3 p.m. EST. And also Instagram Live as well and Twitter and also on the stories for the whole day, like from my breakfast time all the way. <laughs> and then the, the Q&A at, at 3 p.m. But I just really, really want to thank Marie Carlin once more for being the little gem of a person that she is. She's beautiful inside and out. And I want to thank Ronan as well and uh, for those beautiful, beautiful videos. And guys, I'll see you next Monday, 3 p.m. EST for Maraid Mondays. And my amazing guest next week is the fabulous Alison Cambridge Metropolitan Opera Singer, Star of Rocktopia. And I can't wait to talk to her and we'll have exclusive news then as well. Also, just to say thank you again for supporting MoraidNesbettViolin.com and Solstice.shop. Thank you, everyone. You're so amazing. And I just want to have a look at the comments here. Uh, you love Maraid. <laughs> Two devil's bits. Oh, that's very good, Tom. I saw what you did there. <laughs> Wonderful broadcast, Marie. Thank you so much, guys. Uh, thank you. <laughs> Thanks very much, David. I appreciate it. Thanks, Frida. <laughs> so I'm going to see you all tomorrow. Don't forget to put in your questions to Celtic Woman on all their socials and the best question gets a free CD at the free celebration 15 years collection cd and it is uh, an amazing cd so um that'll be a great a great gift to get so see you next week guys uh for Maraid mondays 3 p.m est with alison cambridge thank you so much Maraid carlin of celtic woman and see you tomorrow for tuesday takeovers on celtic woman Mwah. bye <laughs>